what this is washi tape yes I guess I could have been more careful considering these are prints Ooh. these look good I'm so excited no, people were so nice about these, specifically these two illustrations, and I'm really happy with them. Yay! What do you guys think? They're 5 by 7 which I think is a good size. Because, like... Yeah. That's, like, approximately what size print I usually have like postcard to I don't know maybe a bit bigger and then so I only got 25 of these because again I'm not sure how many people will actually purchase the print but they're printed on recycled paper so I'm really happy about that because not many places offer recycled prints for that affordable of a price these are cute too. He's a little mushroom magician. If you follow me on Instagram, you've already seen these illustrations, but these are cute. How many times can I say cute? <laughs> I can't stop looking at myself in my camera because I'm just using my iPhone and I'm on like the front facing camera or whatever. I'll try to look at the camera. They're so cute. Also a bunch of freebies and stuff that my manufacturer sent. Okay, they, they made four of mine in sparkle versions, I guess, but Okay, so spoiler, but not spoiler. These are going up soon. But these are the designs. So I did like a yellow one, yellowy orange with flowers. And then this one's called Hilly Hollow and it has houses. Look at all them. There's 100 of each design. So here are the yellow ones. Oh my gosh. basically just got out of bed and I'm really tired you know those days that are like super gloomy and it's super rainy outside my window and my room didn't even get bright in the morning because it's so cloudy so I just feel like it's not even morning yet and keep in mind it is like 11 30 <laughs> I'm not an early bird But I have a bunch of stuff to do today, so I'm up. I might grab some cereal before I get started. But for my first task is to take pictures of my October spread. It's the only one I have. I didn't do anything else yet. And yes, it is October 4th, 3rd, 4th. I don't know. Wait, let's see. Yep, it's the fourth. <laughs> but yeah, this is all my stationery that I'm using this month. I'm not even going to go through it because it's tons. And some washi tapes. Yeah. 
let's go get some breakfast slash lunch and take some photos hopefully i can post one today and also i'm going to take some product photos of my washi tape and memo pads hopefully but it's really cloudy so i don't think the pictures will be good i think i might actually put them off maybe i'll do that next weekend hopefully it'll be sunnier but uh what was i gonna say oh yeah today i'm gonna pack a bunch of orders actually i think only nine orders and then i have to do patreon mail which is all of these envelopes so that will be fun you can see how gloomy it is outside and then you see me in my purple sweater yay also sticker in my phone case is by ghost puff if you were wondering probably weren't i'll see you soon last night I changed my gallery wall like every season I try to change the prints and stuff to match the season so obviously I changed to autumn and I really like it you can see my little plant he's growing so fast I'm so happy <laughs> my prints on the wall I, these will probably be in the shop by the time I upload this, but it's my first print I've ever made, so I'm really excited. <laughs> Thank you.
Okay, I'm packing Patreon mail right now. And I thought I'd kind of show you what I usually do for Patreon mail. So, basically my snail mail tier. You get two sheets. Usually they're the newest sheet. If I don't have them, then I'll, I'll just put a random one in. But, so, a new sheet, Studio Ghibli, Gourds. Actually aren't even in the shop yet, but sometimes I send my patrons early stuff if I have new designs. And then I'll usually include a freebie flake. Um, my business card if they're a new patron, just because I don't want to waste paper if I know that I've already sent them one. And then a little note to say thank you. And the past few months, which I'm definitely going to continue to do, I put some flakes in here from my own personal stationery collection. They're just random flakes. You guys can see. And this is, like, deep, like, I have so many, like, loose sticker flakes, it's unreal. Like, I'm never gonna be able to use those all. So basically, my patrons get a little de-stash of my stationery collection. Sometimes I'll give them, like, even some memo sheets from, like, memo pads that I have, because I have tons of those, too. But yeah, I've been sealing the orders with these little mushroom stickers, they're really cute. I'm just throwing, honestly, random flakes in. This is my freebie right now, business cards. And I've been stamping with my new stamp, which here I'll show you. All right, well, that was a little left-handed, but that's okay. <laughs> but yeah, you can see all the orders I kind of have to put them on the ground like that for now just because I want the ink to dry so I can't stack them like I usually do but yeah and then I don't want to show their address or mine but that's the little patreon envelope for autumn and I think I'm gonna be changing it seasonally and then I was hoping that people would kind of cut out the design and use it in their journal That'd be kind of cute. But yeah. And also I've been sealing it. It's my new washi tape. Hopefully that's in the store by the time this goes up. But yeah.